Greetings everyone, it's time for another tea review and today I've been to the local supermarket and I've picked up something different. With all the hype and what have you that's going around about mushrooms at the moment on social media, I thought I would try this tea. And it's made by Bravo and it's six mushroom defence tea. And it's supposed to be really healthy for you. Now it's made in the USA. The blend is based on traditional Eastern herbalism. That's what it says on the box. The blend is based on traditional Eastern herbalism. You can have it hot. You can have it cold. It's vegan friendly. And it's caffeine free. Now I've allowed it to steep in the cup for 8 minutes. It says 6 to 8 minutes. It does say you can have two, 1 to 2 tea bags in a cup. But I've only got a small cup. So I've only put 1 tea bag in the cup to start with. And this is the cup of tea, the one I've brewed for six to eight minutes, for eight minutes. Now, it's a nice colour. But, you know, all tea, a lot of teas are basically the same colour. But what you're really interested in, is it going to be any good? Lion's mane mushroom is the first ingredient listed. So, and that's supposed to be good for focus. And I could really do with some help with focusing. So let's just see. If it's going to do me any good or not. But first you want to know what it tastes like. So let's have a snifter first. Hmm. It's got kind of an earthy. Not a really strong smell. Perhaps that's because I haven't used two tea bags. And only used one for a small cup. But it's got an earthy, earthy smell to it. I would identify it definitely as being a mush an earthy mushroomy smell. But not that strong. But what we're really, really interested in is what does it taste like? Is it going to be a good cup of tea? Is it going to be one you sit down with and enjoy? Or is it something you're going to take because it does you good and you don't really enjoy it? That's the thing. What's it going to be? What do you think it's going to be? It Right, it's not an overpowering taste by any means. Maybe it does need two tea bags in the cup, I don't know. I think that's going to be down to personal choice, but I think I'm just going to stick to one. It's nice tasting. It, now, what does it taste like? Earthy mushroom, but not overpowering. There is definitely a mushroom taste there. It definitely does not need any sweetening whatsoever. You would not want to add any honey or sugar to this. It, it's... It has to be drunk. It needs to be drunk as it is. And that's in my opinion, of course. But it's not bad. It really is not a bad cup of tea. It's quite pleasant. I've tasted a lot of teas that are a lot worse than this. It really is quite pleasant. It's got earthy undertones. But you can taste the mushroom after it's gone down. You can. It, leaves a, it does leave a faint taste of mushroom in your mouth. Would I buy it again? Probably. If it, I'm going to see if it helps with the old focus and what have you. But yeah, I definitely don't think it would be one that I'd bypass. It was in the 6 to $7 range for 20 tea bags. And they do advise 1 to 2 tea bags in your cup. There is one warning on the box. If you're pregnant or nursing, you should consult a doctor before you start drinking it. So just remember, always read the boxes and make sure you're fully aware of what it is that you're drinking, especially when you're drinking health supplements like this. Now, and how does it come? One thing I do like about this tea is the tea bags are individually wrapped. They come in paper packages and there's tea bags inside. So that means you, once you've opened it, 
then all the rest of them are not going to go stale. They're going to stay fresh because they are in their own individual little paper packets. And I love that. I don't know why all teas don't do this. Put them in little packets like that. Then you can flick through them. You know, it makes sense. Don't just stick them in a bag we all, all together. They want to be packaged individually like this. They look attractive. They look nice. You can read the back of the packet. You know, it's got something to read while it's brewing. Come on, guys. Get out there. Get with the program. Give us something. Give us something to read when we're make, brewing our tea. But it's, I say, it's made by Bravo Tea, Bravo Teas and Herbs, Inc. It's made in the USA. So you should be able to find it in all your local stores. I think I found this in, in Sprouts, if I remember rightly. And it was in the $6 to $7 price range. But what I want to know is, I like the tea. I think it's a good tea to have. But I'd be really, really interested to know, have you tried this tea? If you have, what did you think of it? So if you could leave that in the comments below. If you haven't tried this tea, have you tried any other mushroom teas that you think I should go out there and try? And what did you think of them? Did they help you? And do they help with focus? Is it a myth or is it reality? Do these teas actually help with focus? Because I would love to get something that helps you with focus. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you've liked the video. If you have and you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you don't like the video, hit the thumbs down. So till the next time, I'll say TTFN and I'm going to go and finish my cup of tea and get some focusing done.